Well, the hunt to stomp out the city's lanternfly population continues tonight. The invasive pests seem to be sticking around despite our best efforts to kill them. Arthur Jan caught up with some New Yorkers still fighting the good fight. On a good day, reporters are not part of the story. On this day, lanternflies decided we are. The creepy, not so tiny creatures are taking New York by unwanted storm, seemingly proliferating in recent weeks. Here, there, everywhere. Do you feel like you're seeing more in the city lately or? Uh, yes, for sure. I see a lot of bugs crawling around and it's really scary because they're so dangerous. With two Shoot distinct them. sets of wings, one brown, the other one bright red, feeding on dozens of species of plants and trees, scientists have said they are unstoppable since they have no natural predators. Ah, uh, but welcome to New York, guys, where citizens have turned merciless mercenaries to protect nature. First spotted in Pennsylvania in 2014 and then turned up in New Jersey, then crawled onto Staten Island, and now it's an all out war on Manhattan streets from Battery Park to the Upper East Side. It can hitchhike on vehicles um, as well as other types of goods and move from place to place, but also you can have uh, long distance transport. Uh, in the egg stage. At risk, the $300 million wine industry in New York with vineyards stretching from Long Island to upstate. Moises Lopez Perez is a landscaper. He and his crew have been fighting the good fight at the urging of scientists. They're going to eat our, our flowers. Where are you seeing them? Normally in the flower beds and oh. all the beds, yeah, because that eat all the flowers. And what do you guys do when you see them? Try to kill them the most that we can, oh. hitting it with something. These things are more than a nuisance. They can kill 70 species of plants and trees, and they're not afraid of anything, including my cameraman's leg. We won't tell you how it turned out for that guy or for the one that climbed up my neck and then over my head. Let's just say it ain't just the rents that are brutal in New York. And hello, guys. Let's see what you think about our winters. Arthur Chien, Fox 5 News.